All right, day 15. Uh, day started out with running to Lowe's to pick up my overhead cabinets, and of course, they only had one of the four that I needed, and I picked up a sink, so the sink is here when the uh, countertop people come to lay out the uh, template, the countertop. And, you know, I gotta say, I say this all the time, and I'm really getting frustrated with Home Depot and Lowe's. Um, they've become more of a DIY store than a contractor store. Um, every time I go in there, it doesn't matter what project I'm working on, they're either out of or they don't uh, have stuff in the right place, or it's it's just become very frustrating as as. A person who does the type of work that I do that where I need all kinds of things so all right I got that out of my system <laughs> um, I've got the priming most of the priming done trim baseboards I uh, started these doors I got primed uh, I got a load out of the basement into the trailer for the dump um, that won't go until Monday. And I started working on this bathroom. Pulled this uh, bead board off of here, most of it anyway. And uh, wouldn't you know it, they glued it. So I'm gonna have to work this, this wall. Um, it's already pretty fragile as it is. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Pulled the medicine cabinet off and you know, uh, I'm never surprised anymore at what I find behind stuff. So I've got a nice big hole there that I've got to cover up. Uh, more beadboard. I guess that's where the old TP holder was. And I opened up this shower. Taking this plastic shower surround off. And uh, I was real, real concerned that there was going to be tile underneath there. But there isn't. There's just adhesive. Once again, that I have to get off of here so I can lay tile on there. So I don't know what's worse. This is adhesive or tile that I may have had to remove. So, uh, yeah. And then over here we've got, I guess there was water damage at one time. Uh, that's why they must have threw that bead board up there. But the uh, floor in the corner right there. Uh, is a little water damage as well. It's uh, only the top The finished floor these the substrate is fine. I went down in the basement and looked at that and uh, It's it's not rotted through so I may have to just uh, Cut a little bit out and throw a piece of plywood in there or something But uh, yeah, look at this wall. Look at this stuff. I Don't know what the hell that is <laughs> Uh, whatever it is, it's probably got asbestos in it, and I know this paint's probably got lead in it because this house is 60 years old, 65 years old. So, yeah, I'm living in a cancer cell. <laughs> yeah, all right, so uh, I'm probably just going to do a little bit more and then call it a day. That's it.